you have to say? Anything? I'm like talking to myself even when I'm talking to you. When do you come back? October 6th. But if you're broke now, then how are we going to make it then? <laughs> and, it's, and it's Monday. And it's at 6. Yeah, well, I get paid in October, dumb dumb. What you say about that stuff? I think you're the only person that takes care of me. Huh? Why did I say that? Because you're the only person that takes care of me. I don't know, Mary this is it. <clears throat> October 6, huh? What you guys talk about today? I told her how scared I was of her soul going in my face telling me that I'm not telling her the right thing to get on medication for craziness. Uh, what she say? Time I see it, I'm trying to explain it to her, but it's like talking to myself. Yeah, what she say? She said that she put me on the waiting list. A waiting list? How big is the she waiting said list? The only <laughs> she did not go there with me, but she said the only way that I'll be able to see the doctor is if I keep seeing her. Just keep seeing her? For how long? I asked her that, and she said, there's no way I can answer you. How long is the waiting list? It's going to be pretty long if they can't get me in right now. Yeah. I don't feel safe going back to the house yet. Well. And I called mom, and then she said, tell her she'll call me as soon as she gets there. Tell your mom you want. I don't have no money. Did you tell your mom you wanted to come over there? Oh hey, if we stop at an ashtray, I'm gonna go rob an ashtray. No, you're not. <laughs> you can get AIDS and stuff from it, you dummy. Well, I got a free cigarette out of the parking lot. Yeah, or well, you can get AIDS off that one too. But of course, he don't care. As long as the doctor says I'm perfectly healthy, I don't need to do it. Did you ask your mom if you could come over there? Yes, I did. And what'd she say? No, I can't. Did you work?